Does LDN help with prostate cancer? That is a yes. Uh, there is de definite data with that. And what I will say is that LDN, because cancer is based in inflammation and usually viral in nature, and a lot of times has pain associated with that, but when you follow how low-dose naltrexone, so naltrexone in low doses works on the opiate growth-like receptor, that opiate growth factor receptor can be blocked, which can also negate the growth of a lot of tumors. We've seen that in the first book and also in Dr. Anderson's book and also subsequent chapters in the second and third book where low-dose naltrexone was implemented, for example, four weeks after. So there was a PET scan done it initially and then four weeks later and the tumors are significantly shrunk. We have data that shows and published study that shows where low-dose naltrexone has allowed the practitioners to decrease the amount of chemotherapy issued at any given time. So again, to decrease the severity of the reaction and side effects to chemo. Pretty amazing stuff. Dr. Paul Anderson's book, Cancer, Dr. Paul Anderson speaks for the trust often. Again, you can go out to the website, you can put in Dr. Paul Anderson, you can put in cancer, prostate cancer. There's been a wide variety of practitioners that have spoken for the trust in the past that can very clearly explain this. Dr. Angus Dalglish, oh, I love that man. He's in, in Scotland, I believe. And he also has done a lot of research on LDN cancer and even included cannabidiol.